Hi everyone, iRobot owners. If you buy an iRobot, especially when coming from an IT background like myself, you think that setting it up and connecting it to your Wi-Fi really can't be difficult. Honestly, I didn't waste a thought on that. And as a talented user even, you think, well, whatever, I there's a forum online and another one and tutorials on YouTube galore. There's the help desk, whatever. So what could really go wrong there, right? So long story short, I found that there's two issues that may come up and that I faced that do not appear as solutions on any forum that I found and that users reported could also not be solved by the help desk. So let's look at those ones. The first one would be the initial setup fails even, so you can't get your device connected. And the second one was that iRobot ran for a while. It set up the maps and was all fine. And then suddenly one day it reports a disconnect from the Wi-Fi and wouldn't reconnect even if all recommendations are followed, like unplugging the Wi-Fi, rebooting the iRobot and so forth. So let me go through both cases briefly because it may help the community and so that's why I put this video together. The solutions are like really straightforward and easy to implement. So let's look at the first one. The initial setup doesn't work. So besides the common recommendations that we found is that you may have a master Wi-Fi and a guest access, like a Wi-Fi for guests with two separate logins, with two separate logins. And in that case, the iRobot and the device with the iRobot app need to be logged into the same network. In this case, it needs to be the master network. Why is this? So typically the guest networks are set up in such a way that the guest devices cannot detect and like see each other. This is set up your iRobot to the guest network and the device carrying the app to the master network, those two devices wouldn't detect each other. So the fix is easy. You connect your iRobot to your and your mobile device, both to the master network, and then the setup will run smoothly, All right? Okay. So then the second issue is that if your iRobot was fine and in use for quite a while and did a great job, and it suddenly would disconnect from the Wi-Fi and would refuse reconnecting. Now, you were advised to check your Wi-Fi connection, and of course you did, and of course it, um, it it did work. You unplugged it, you plugged it back in, you switched off the iRobot, switched it back on, uh, reset it to factory settings, maybe even you tried that. Um, like here on the app, where, where do you find those things? Let me, let me show you. The, here on the app on the bottom, you have the robot settings, and then you see on the bottom, remove factory reset, and there you go. And then in the middle, you see also the Wi-Fi settings, right? Okay, so let's go back. But still, even you did all that, the problem would persist. So also here, the fix seems rather to be an easy one. You would just switch off the iRobot and then you get yourself a coffee and you go on a 10 minute coffee break, all right? And only then you switch your robot back on, okay? It seems to be the case that the iRobot only resets after a longer off time, not if it's just being switched off and right back on again, right? Like with any other device, certain components like a Wi-Fi adapter inside the thing can hang and that's totally okay actually, if it only happens occasionally, right? A reboot usually fixes this problem and this seems to be the case here as well. The key to the solution seems to be the 10 minute wait uh, for the reset. That's all about it. So that was it and I wish you good luck and a lot of fun with your iRobot. Happy to hear in the comments how it's going. All right, bye.